This presentation is on SLP4 Organizational Management. The title of my project is Cookies at the Creek, a Rising Sixth Grade Parent Night. Broad Creek Middle School is a grade six to eight school in Carteret County. It is a high performing school. It is located on Highway 24 in Newport, North Carolina and serves 720 students. White Oak and Bogue Sound Elementary feed into Broad Creek Middle School. Broad Creek students then attend Croatan High School. Carteret County is consistently ranked in the top five districts in the state. This school has a heavy military population and a full-time military family counselor, as well as two full-time school counselors and a third part-time school counselor that was funded through Esser's money. Mrs. Weinhold, the current principal, is serving her eighth year. The first step in this project was to collect data. Many sources were used to determine current areas of need. The data pointed toward a need for better organizational management when it comes to sixth grade transition. The administrators and counselors input determined a lot of time was being spent explaining processes to students and parents of sixth graders. Discipline data also supported this area of need. After working closely with the principal and assistant principal and looking over all the identified areas of improvement, we determined the best way to improve our organizational systems was to hold a parent night for rising sixth grade families. This night would be for parents only and focus on the processes of middle school and how parents can best support their students during the transition. The next step in the process was to identify what researchers are saying about this topic of middle school transition. Based on the quotes here, the following conclusions could be made. Research suggests procedural changes are an upset, upset not only to parents, but also to students. Providing an informational meeting for parents will help notify them and prepare students for these procedural changes before they start in the fall. Discipline is part of procedural expectations parents and students must be made aware of when transitioning to middle school. Our counselors are struggling to keep up with their daily job duties because of the challenges sixth grade students face in a post-COVID environment. This event will help develop the relationship between new students, parents, and staff. After collecting research, a plan was created to complete the project. The first step was to get feedback from sixth grade teachers on what they think parents need to know. Then input was gathered from the data manager, bookkeeper, athletic director, counselors, social worker, nurse, and administration. The counselors and I created the presentation and selected a date. The bookkeeper and I created a budget for cookies and drinks at the event. I asked two sixth grade teachers that serve on leadership team to attend, so we had representation for the grade level. Then we advertised the event. It will be held on May 18th. Although the event has not been held yet, everyone involved is hopeful we will have a large turnout and see positive results. After the fall semester, I will look at discipline data and counselors will look at their referral form data to see if there has been a positive change in the number of sixth grade students being written up or needing to check in with counselors. The sixth grade teachers will also complete a survey with feedback on how the night has affected students' work completion and the number of parent emails with questions about grades and processes. I have already received positive input from stakeholders saying that the event is a great idea and they are hopeful we will see a positive change in the fall. Thank you for watching my digital story on Cookies at the Creek.